a lot of things are happening. I don't even know. I've been going through a lot through this. Like, ever since I moved to where I live now, a lot of stuff has been happening. I can't even find a friend where nothing happens or where they talk crap behind my back. I'm freaking sick of all of this. My parents don't understand. Nobody around here understands. I try to tell someone that I want to move and nothing even happens. And I gave my heart to someone who I really love. And she, I can't even see her now. She, she had something bad that she did and she's sent away. She like ran away or something. But I loved her so much and I gave her a lot. I gave. We haven't been dating for a while. And now she's gonna be gone for a while. And. I'm losing friends constantly, is what I'm saying. I'm losing a lot of people that I know constantly because they don't know how to keep their mouth shut, they don't know how to not say, start rumors. I don't even know. When, for example, I'm saying that people around here are like, when they're around with me, my, like, my friends, when they're with me, they're really nice to me. But then, when I am not hanging out with them, that's all I do is talk crap behind me, behind my back. And I'm really sick of it. Just give me some time to think for a little bit. I'm... I might be getting depressed, to be honest. My parents don't even understand. I'll talk in a little bit. I just gotta think about some stuff right now. I had to move the camera so then you guys can see me better. But But then the thing is if me and my girlfriend are still dating and we like move away or something then it's gonna be hard for me. I mean at least I wanna like Cause my parents aren't like, they're like split apart. So like, I'm sorry. It's kind of dark right now. I would want like, my mom kind of like actually does this though. I wanna be able to go live with her. Because I don't want to, I don't even want to be in Bergen no more. I'm actually really sick of the, all of this. I don't even know what to say right now. And if this like same thing happens to you guys then you guys will understand what I'm feeling right now and YouTube 
I I really thank all of you guys for 100 subscribers. But that's not the point right now. <laughs> my friend Damien. Well, he's not my friend no more. Ever since he came back, all this dumb stuff has been going on. And I'm sure you guys never have seen me cry on YouTube before. Or you guys like as have never seen me like this. I'm actually pretty emotional right now. Uh, it's it's like really a blessing for you guys to understand and like guide me through all of this for like what I'm going through right now and I don't I don't even know how long my girlfriend's gonna get sent to wait I loved her a lot. I can, I can just imagine, like, her coming here and giving me a hug right now for what I'm feeling. And I didn't even get to, like, say anything to her before she went away. And I really miss my grandpa. I had a lot of fun with my grandpa. I've changed a lot ever since he passed away. I haven't. <laughs> we had a lot of fun. I'm, I'm so glad that he was my grandpa. I've messed up a lot ever since he passed away. And like, my dad always told me that, like try to be good, get my grades up and I'm in summer school and I'm gonna just freaking grow up to be Some guy on the road just like nowhere to go and <laughs> I don't even know what to do anymore right now. <laughs> Sorry about my dog, guys. I'm like falling apart, to be honest. That's what I'm feeling like. <laughs> Maybe I'm happy on the outside, but that doesn't mean I am on the inside. And all those people where I'm from, they don't get it. All they do is hurt my feelings or something or say something bad or threaten me. But that's all you gotta say. Make sure to subscribe, guys. Bye.